Hi, quick concealer tip to share with you today. You'll notice I already have my makeup all done. So I know what you're thinking. I normally put, and have in the past, I've put concealer underneath and wherever I need to touch ups before I put any of my other makeup on. Well, I have changed my ways now that I am using this concealer. So I have all my makeup already done, powder, eyes, all that stuff. And I'm gonna come in, this is the concealer and it's powder concealer. So you're gonna tap it in to the lid a little bit here. And I have my concealer brush and I'm gonna grab the powder. You know how when you get your eyes done and you're gonna take this and start coming in here. When you get and work with your eyes, you always have a little bit of stuff sometimes that has fallen underneath. This takes care of that problem when you wait till afterwards to do it. So I'm coming in and just covering up a little bit in here and blending it in. See how I'm kind of tapping and moving. And then, so that's one problem area, and then we all, well, some of you don't and you are lucky, <laughs> have blemish problems. I do have blemish problems. So, as you can see, there's a beauty right there. So. I'm going to take this and just tap around it. See how I'm doing that moving the brush, tapping around. I'm going to grab just a little bit more here. When you use the cream stuff, and I've always had this problem too, especially because that skin gets dry around those areas. Um, when you use that cream stuff, it brings that out more. It shows the dryness. It looks like you're trying to cover something up, right? This helps to flake away some of that dead skin as well as cover. So again, we'll go in and do that. A little something up here too. Voila! I can't remember. I did have one up here. Let's see if I can kind of cover that. And this lighting is horrible, but natural light is good. That's a little bright this morning. There we go. I don't cover up this because that's one of my one of my beauty marks. We'll call it that. I like that there. So covering up. There we go. That's how easy that is. So something again that I didn't know. Wait till after your makeup's done. Blend it on. You want to make sure you have the right color. I am personally using Fabulous right now and that just goes with my skin tone really well but they have a bunch of different colors for you to use too. So try that out. I want to see what you guys think. Um, like I said, covers a lot better than when you put the cream and it's not screaming. I have concealer on it. Thanks so much. Enjoy playing with your makeup.